At Methanex, in partnership with MOL and others, we've been proving methanol as a marine fuel since 2016. Today, methanol has emerged as a marine fuel for the future, and our net zero voyage continues to prove it. In early February 2023, the methanol-fueled vessel Cajun Sun successfully completed the first ever net zero voyage fueled by a blend of conventional and biomethanol. Operated by Methanex's subsidiary Waterfront Shipping and chartered from MOL, the Cajun Sun completed this landmark transatlantic voyage, proving that the pathway to net zero emissions and the decarbonization of the shipping industry is possible today. Biomethanol is produced from organic waste. In this case, animal manure. The manure is collected and stored in tanks so that the methane gas, which is 25 times more powerful as a greenhouse gas than CO2, can be captured instead of released into the atmosphere. This methane gas is then processed to remove impurities and become renewable natural gas, also known as RNG. This RNG is pipeline quality and sent by the same pipeline as conventional natural gas. By mixing the materials within the same system, we avoid the additional costs and emissions that would come from building a parallel pipeline. We use a process called mass balance, where the same amount of RNG is delivered from the pipeline at our facility in Geismar, Louisiana, as was originally injected. Mass balance is a smart and easy way to scale up the use of renewables by shifting and replacing fossil materials. The RNG is converted into methanol and loaded onto our ship. This fuel is loaded through the same pipeline that is used to transport conventional methanol to the vessel. When fueling was complete, the vessel departed Geismar and embarked on its journey to Antwerp. The fuel used on the transatlantic voyage was a fuel blend comprised of ISCC-certified biomethanol that has negative carbon intensity and natural gas-based methanol. Because the emissions released from the voyage were those captured during the biomethanol production, zero greenhouse gas emissions were achieved on a life cycle basis. This innovative fuel solution offers shipping companies the ability to achieve net zero carbon emissions on a life cycle basis today, supporting the industry's transition to a low carbon future. After 18 days at sea, the Cajun Sun arrived in Antwerp, Belgium. On board, the terminal loading master met with the chief officer and the surveyor to review safety checklists, ensuring that everything between ship and shore is ready for cargo offloading. Bureau Veritas, one of the world's leading certification bodies, and Climate Neutral Commodity, an independent certification party, audited and validated the greenhouse gas emission calculations from the biomethanol fuel blend consumed during the voyage, and certification was issued. This landmark voyage showcases that the pathway to net zero emissions and the decarbonization of the shipping industry is possible today, with methanol as a marine fuel. For more information about this landmark net zero voyage or methanol as a lower carbon marine fuel, visit methanex.com.